Hundreds of volunteers are heading out to Lake Sammamish State Park. So they're taking part in the annual Mountains to Sound Greenway Trust Tree Planning. So our very own Ellen Taylor joining us there live this morning, <laughs> talking with the organizers and volunteers about the impact this event will make. Good morning, Ellen. Yeah. Hello. Good morning. Uh, you know, it is. Uh, thank you, Grace, for creating this beautiful day for us. I mean, I know you just like predict the weather, but really, I'm going to give Grace credit for this wonderful day because I know, Caroline, you're happy that it's not raining. You're one of the volunteer coordinators here. Um, let's actually let's kind of back up because we're already planting some trees. There's this big space here at Lake Sammamish Park. What the heck is happening here and why are we doing this? Awesome. So we are out here planting about 1,500 trees with volunteers. Around 200 volunteers are about to show up to do all of this work. And we're out here to restore the ecological area of Issaquah Creek within Lake Sammamish State Park. Now, Caroline, 1,500 of these trees are going to be going into the ground. Yeah. That's a lot of trees. Why that many? That many trees? Well, we're part of planting 1 million trees in King County okay. by 2020. So we're planting a lot of trees in Lake Sammamish State Park. It's a really important area for trees. We're trying to restore this area that used to be full of blackberry, which is an invasive species. So sure. we're restoring it. We're restoring it. And I mean, we're getting down and dirty like yeah. this. I mean, you might have seen me just a couple of minutes ago getting down here, holding the tree. And then like literally it took you two seconds to just kind of put that down. Is it that easy to do? Well, I've, I've probably planted around 1500 trees myself. So um, with that, I know uh, it can be look kind of quick, but volunteers, we like to take a lot of time, keep quality really sure. high. Um, sure. Yeah. So about takes about 15 minutes probably to plant a tree. All right. And then if I can actually kind of show you, there's this big wide open space around here too. You said you're expecting about 200 volunteers this morning. Mm -hmm. um, if someone's watching right now, how can they help you guys in this project? Is this something that they can come and do today? Because there's a lot of space that needs to be filled with these brand new trees and if they can't help today how can they help you guys in the future because i'd imagine this is not a one type of one day deal it's not a one day deal no restoration is a long-term process we have volunteer events the mountain mountains to sound greenway trust has volunteer events every saturday oh. where people are coming out planting trees restoring trails really being stewards of our local environment so yeah. there's plenty more to to do okay so then again if someone does want to come and check it out where do i go to get that information because i like to get down and dirty and i'm down to help out the environment but where do i go if i want to come help out yeah we have a website mtsgreenway.org we have an instagram um, out of sound greenway and we post all of our events on that we have a volunteer calendar you'll see our flyer around town yeah. um yeah lots of places to check it out definitely okay so caroline thank you so much i know you got a lot of work to do and again uh this is happening today 1500 trees are going to to be planted today. That sounds like a lot, but when you break that down into 200 volunteers, I mean, together we can make it happen. What is it? Uh, teamwork makes the dream work, right? And it will, of course, make this place even more beautiful than it already is. We're actually going to stay here throughout the morning and give you updates on what this whole progress looks like. Again, why these folks are doing it and how you can help out too. And again, big kudos to Grace for keeping the rain away. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> I got no video.